Come, come! The wedding is soon to start! How grand! A beautiful and worthy celebration, my lord! Thank you. May this feast set a spirited tone for East Anglia. Just like you to keep a king waiting at his own wedding! Yet I arrived in the end. A part of me worried you wouldn't. I told you I would see you crowned. Now here we are. Without you, I'd be dead. Another wasted hope for East Anglia. You look good, Oswald. Like a man about to marry a more powerful woman. Do I? Because I'm nervous as hell. Of all the battles a man can fight, the war against himself is the hardest to win. I hereby name you man and wife, and as man and wife, I name you... Oswald of Elmenham, first of his name, the rightful king of East Anglia, with his Lady Valdis, soul, fist, and beauty of this land. You've done it, steward. A king now sits on the throne of East Anglia. Don't leave yourself out of this song. We did it together. Back to your dreams, then, of fire and Helheim. I lost my way some time ago. Hard to say when. I don't want to be here. I never did. This was half Dan's dream. He ordered me to see it through. In my dreams, I'm sailing, remember? Wind in my beard, salt on my lips. I want that life again. Whether or not I find it, only time will tell. Until then, let us feast, drink, and forget our pain! Eivor! Wolf kissed. Gaze upon my parts. They stand so strong. Unbreakable at this distance, no? They are not, Brothier. My arrows shatter whatever target they strike. Even after draining so much meat, succeed and you shall be rewarded. 
Keep your eyes open long enough to witness this, you drunken loud. Everything an easy task for the wood kist. Ah, barely a challenge. Impressive, impressive. Here as promised. Now go enjoy the party. Score, Ivor. Let your fist is without hail. Let us address that. Surely a special kind of metal is required for drinking before the new king? A metal not unlike your own. To Odin and his endless glories! And the new king of East Anglia! May his reign be long and good! Not bad, Wolf Kissed. I wager you couldn't drink more than me if you tried. <laughs> A fool's wager. A challenge nonetheless. What say you? I will drink you under the table. <laughs> Confident, are you? Let us see how you fare against the ale beast of East Anglia. And we'll make it interesting. Put your silver where your mouth is. What say you? I accept. Strong, but I am stronger. <laughs> I stronger than me. You drink as well as Valdis. Now that I would pay to see. Speaking of payment, where is my silver? Here, well earned, Wolf Kissed. The boar represents fertility. Did you know that? As does Freya. What's your point? You impress me, Eivor. Your battle wisdom, your strength of character, skilled in so many ways. Yet I wonder, is there any skill of mine that I could impress upon you? Even a fool has something to teach, whether they are aware of the lesson or not. Hey, hey. But I could show you how to wield my plow sword. Sheath your plow sword, bro dear. I'm not interested. Uh, you you thought? No, <laughs> no. I wasn't serious. Come on now, drink and be merry. Well, I had a few friend. Wait, did you hear? Did my brother just call me? I think he. You know I should go. Brother! Behold, how light-footed I am! You're as light-footed as a bear in a birch tree. These are the moves of Elmenhar. Eivor, Eivor! Some sweet! 
sweet wine for a sweet swine? <laughs> Come join me! Saxon God wanders somewhere up here, does he not? I haven't seen him. They like to say he moves with mystery. Look! The moon! It moves on trouble now. But one day it will be eaten by a giant wolf and the nights will be black forevermore. Are you all right? I've tasted glory once again. And it was good. I'm glad to hear it. Now... I always felt like Skull or Hati. Chasing and trying to fulfill Halfdan's wishes. But now I've caught my sun and moon. I've got them and I... I don't know. You can let them go. Sail to a further shore. My long ship's in Valhalla. But don't you remember? Fire starter. <gasps> Come on, let's get you to solid ground. Everything's spinny. You're very strong. You're very large. <laughs> Sorry for this, Eivor. I've had one last glory. I should be happy. I am happy. Thank you. It need not be the last. Not the last. <laughs> mm. Enough fun and games. I should see how Oswald is doing. Eivor, I'm about to address our guests, and I'd like you to be there. It's been a worthy ceremony so far. And have you had enough fun yet? I'm ready to hear you address your kingdom. Good. Come, come. Join me. Friends, honored guests. We've pushed through hard times. It seems like all we've known is loss and suffering. But it is not conflict that binds us. It is compassion. May we always favor compassion, even when our enemies refuse its boon. So to my Dane friends and neighbors, I give thanks for the bravery you have shown during our collective struggles. And for my fellow Christians, may we continue standing as examples of our Lord's grace. Lights in the dark. I see East Anglia's future right here, right now, in all of you, Dane and Saxon alike. To our future. Still a bit soft on insults, but the king has courage. And to Eivor, without whom none of this would have been possible. On behalf of East Anglia, let this ring be proof of our loyalty to the Raven Clan and all they have done for us today. Would you have any words of wisdom for us? Oswald, you would not have been my first choice as king, nor my second. I thought you weak, bendable without resolve. But not all men are as they first appear. I came to see that Oswald's heart is amongst the largest I've ever known. He is sturdy, he has wisdom, and he has courage. All qualities of a man worthy to be king. He is the king East Anglia deserves, and the king you need. To the good King Oswald! To Oswald! Skull! 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 Okay, everyone, the bridal race starts now. Remember, you all have to lose to the bride and groom. Quick, brother! We can't lose to Oswald. Yeah. <laughs> 
You lost. <laughs> It was a beautiful wedding, Oswald. Like you said it would be. Thanks to you and everything you've done here. It won't be easy putting the pieces of East Anglia back together. But you won't be alone. Saxon and Dane have banded together in your name. You are the right man for the throne, and they'll be with you. Thank you, Eivor. I don't know what to say. When we met, I spoke of an alliance. Will you hold to the oath you made? I will. Consider East Anglia a friend of the Raven Clan. There will be a day when I come calling. Goodbye, friend. Until next time, Great King. We should find Finn here. Say goodbye before I leave. Ah! Greetings, Eivor! You're missing the festivities. I've had my fill. It's as much yours as it is Oswald's. I was a crumbling man, Eivor. Before all this, I thought I'd die a tired old failure. But now, my heart burns bright with newfound fire. I want to live hard, die fierce! Glory cares not for age, Finir. Sail with me. My ship could always use a wise head and a strong axe. Together? Together. I'll gather my things. What a celebration! Now it seems the wind calls me back to Randvi. Let's tell her the good news. A dream come true, like none other. Thank you for everything. From the bottom of my heart. Maybe peace is the way of things now. Of all this... Will you not stay a moment longer, Eivor? I should not linger. My bannerfolk await my return. I understand. Take care, Valdis. You fought well, and won yourself a worthy king. I did, didn't I? Take care, Eivor. Mona, my help. Brother, Oswald is in your hands now. Protect your king, and call out to my banner, should the need arise. Aye, Eivor, without a moment's hesitation. Travel safe. I will, friend. <laughs> Brodeer, look after Oswald, will you? Aye, he is family now. And I could not be more proud of him. <laughs> we have you to thank for that. <laughs> Take care.